having the KNUST reopened, hopefully by Thursday, the 8th of November, 2018. Now, as you recall, the outbreak of violence and destruction of property following a student demonstration on October 22nd is what compelled government to move in and intervene with a series of emergency and interim measures on the KNUST campus. Though the interim council that was put in place has been given up to three months, government's subsequent assessment is that it can hand over the university and all the emergency measures taken to a new council earlier than expected, if one is agreed upon and inaugurated as soon as possible. Government has indicated its proposed new members to the KNUST Council. We've submitted our names to the Office of the Chancellor. It is our understanding that two other groups, CHAS and NCT, have also done so. That's our understanding. Our expectation is that once the Office of the Chancellor received the full complement of the names, the Office of the Chancellor will refer them to the appointing authority, that is the President, for the next steps. And the next steps are that the Council of State will uh, give its approval, and then the final inauguration of the new Council is expected to be done by the appointing authority, or if the appointing authority delegates to um, another party, so to do that party will do that inauguration. Regrettably, we missed the Friday, November 1 timeline by which time we were hoping to have had the full complement of the list. But we are hopeful that all the parties will cooperate so that we can inaugurate a new council and hand over the interim and emergency measures that we have had to take to handle the situation to this new council.